a mysterious halt. Plane's data transmission ceases before crash. In a sequence of events marked by uncertainty, a plane crash north of Moscow has unfolded with perplexing details. The chronicle begins with the abrupt cessation of data transmission from the plane's transponders around 6.11 p.m. local time, as revealed by flight tracking data from Flight Radar 24. The aircraft in question, an Embraer Legacy registered to Yevgeny Prigozhin. The head of the enigmatic Wagner Private Military Group was observed at a cruising altitude over the TA Vera region after departing from a Moscow airport. Yet, the flow of data encapsulating speed and altitude suddenly came to a halt, leaving a void of information and a growing sense of mystery. The presence of Prigozhin's name among the passengers adds a layer of intrigue, casting shadows of suspicion over the crash. This particular aircraft has been linked to Prigozhin's movements in the past, connecting him between Rostov-on-Don and various destinations like Moscow, St. Petersburg, and Belarus. While Flight Radar and 24's flight transponder, data remains bereft of conclusive insights. One point remains clear. The sudden termination of data transmission occurred over the WR region in Russia, with no drastic descent recorded before the signal vanished. The plane's intended destination is believed to be St. Petersburg, yet the ambiguity persists, echoing the broader enigma of this tragic incident. Breeze clues. Video and registration numbers unveil connections. Amid the somber debris left in the wake of the crash, Puzzling fragments begin to intertwine, offering fragments of answers in a sea of questions. Captured on video engine debris from the purported crash site in the TV region, northwest of Moscow, bears a conspicuous link to Yevgeny Prigozhin. Intriguingly, the video unveils the last four digits of a registration number on the still-burning engine debris, 2795. It is a number that resonates with Prigozhin's registered plane, identified as Ray 2795. Further scrutiny extending to the engine's distinct features, including its color, strengthens the link between the debris and Prigozhin's aircraft. Visual evidence amplifies the narrative, with footage released by the official Russian news agency Ryan Novosti depicting a plane resembling the size and shape of the Embraer, descending almost vertically from the sky. Like Data Chronicles, its ascent to an altitude of approximately 26,000 feet before the abrupt cessation of information transmission, marking the harrowing end of its ill-fated journey. Quest for Answers. Russian Aviation Authority initiates investigation. Amid the tragedy that unfolded in the TV region, Russian aviation authority Rosaviation has taken the initiative to unravel the complex web of circumstances surrounding the crash, forming a specialized commission. The authority has embarked on a rigorous investigation into the accident involving the Embraer 135 aircraft on August 23. This aircraft was under the ownership of Mindyr OLC, a company specializing in business transportation. Preliminary information highlights the presence of seven passengers and three crew members on board as the aircraft traversed the Moscow-St. Petersburg route. With a comprehensive focus on factors spanning crew training, technical conditions of the aircraft, meteorological conditions along the flight path, dispatch services, and ground radio equipment, the investigation aims to construct a comprehensive understanding of the events leading to the tragic incident. The probing will extend to seeking onboard means of objective control, including the decoding and analysis of the flight recorder's data. As this meticulous inquiry commences, the Aviation Authority seeks to unearth the truth hidden amidst the wreckage, providing solace and answers to the families affected by this grievous incident.